Outwit, outplay, outlast. Those three words have defined a generation as the motto of the hit television franchise, Survivor. They also describe the television industry to absolute perfection. No one knows about either, but then our guest today. He, at the young age of 18, has extensively networked throughout the film industry, seen the inner workings of the business, and directed, produced, and co-starred in his own full-length documentary. He is an aspiring on-screen actor and a raw talent who only continues to climb up the entertainment ladder. Today's guest will talk about these and other unique experiences which he experienced during the television production study. The Humanities Communication Arts Department at Norwalk Community College presents The New Directors, the show that introduces you to television's future writers, directors, and personalities. And now join our host, Ayub Wampella, to meet the new directors. Thank you for joining us for today's edition of the new directors. All of the people involved with this program are students in the television production course. And they are directing, switching, controlling, audio operating cameras, and acting as talent for the first time today. The guests you are about to meet are students who, when not on camera, are behind the scenes working hard to bring this program to you with as few mistakes as possible. Each student will write and direct four different productions. This program will give them the chance to talk about themselves, the production they are planning to, to give you, the chance to get to know them and watch their progress throughout the semester. Our guest today is an aspiring screen talent who already is sizing, directing, and editing, editing his name slowly and ascending his way up the under entertainment ladder and the thread have him on the program today. We would like you to meet today's guest, Ryan Papola. How are you? Good to Welcome, Ryan. Good to see you. How are you? you I'm fine. Good. Uh, Ryan, how did the making of your documentary poignancy Precise come about? Well, I, I was a huge fan of the TV show Survivor, huge fan since the beginning, and uh, I'm friends with Rob Sestronino on MySpace. One day I'm on MySpace and Rob had a contest. Um, the person who writes the best essay of sorts will um, get to play uh, fantasy football with me and the people he plays with. I entered thinking, why not? Just do it for fun. I, I sent my uh, audition, if you will, in, and he picked me. From there, I started to play fantasy football with uh, him and the guys, and one thing led to another. We became very good friends. Um, so Rob is... Um, he, uh, him, him and his uh, boss, Z Scott Zacharin, own a production company known Iron Sink Media. They, uh, they've had two shows on E, Kill Reality, which led into The Scorned, which is um, a feature film they had on E! Entertainment Television. Um, from there, they, the, they have basically invented the webisodic TV genre. Anything you see strictly on the internet, shows that are strictly on the internet, they have pretty much uh, targeted that market. They've had some shows as The Downstairs Guys, The Upstairs Girls, uh, Model Ball, Van Nuys Guys, Soup of the Day. They are just the leading people in the, at that field. They have, they have taken the genre to a whole other level besides from just Caridia. Uh, Tim Polari, my good friend, he's one of the actors. He's also in the Fantasy Football League. They also do I work with William Shatner, who they do the Shatner Project with. From there, we, we developed such a good rapport. This just led to the making of uh, a project for my own film class in high school, Poignancy Precise, the phenomenon that is fantasy football. Um, I filmed uh, my teachers and people who were interested in fantasy football here in uh, Connecticut, and uh, I sent them a script. They set up their shots, and they filmed their stuff in California. They gave me hours of footage. It was a great project. I can't, I can't say enough about it. Um, it was a blast to do. It was 44 minutes long. Um, like I said, over two hours of footage. I had a great time making it. I uh, did an interview myself because I'm kind of, you know, a media junkie. I want to be in as many things as possible. But um, it was a great time. Um, I can't, it just honestly, it was a great learning experience for me. And um, the finished product was a really big payoff. 
And um, um, although I didn't win best film, I still think I was, you know, robbed out of my victory for best film in my uh, television production class. The experience I got, got it, getting to work with people who are in the industry and know what they're doing, have success, and so many credits to their name was incredible. And uh, we, our friendship developed even further. And I think it's nothing but a positive for me and my uh, future prospects for a career. See, great. Uh Ryan, your work seems to be very interesting. Thank you. Now, could you tell us why you decided to take the TV production course? Absolutely. Um, the biggest reason was my editing. Uh, I'm an aspiring editor. That's really what I want to do. And uh, I have a very basic program. I wanted to learn a new one. I wanted to you know, expand my horizons. I also had, I, I'm a huge fan of television, all types of television. I was very curious about what goes in to make a television production. You know, you see it on screen, but what happens behind the scenes? Um, I wanted to learn more about the camera, because honestly, I'm not a very big camera person. And that's my least favorite aspect of the television industry. But I knew that I needed to have those basic skills to you know, advance further into the, uh, the line of work I want to do. And uh, hopefully a possible retirement career after I make it my actual career. So you know, I have some nice you know, bridging steps and stones there. You, know? okay. uh, you have interesting plans in your life. And now, what are some of the most useful things you have learned in the television course? Well, as I said, learning a superior program was excellent. You know, I can, I can expand my horizons. I, I now know how to do 100 times more than I did before I took this course. And that is phenomenal. You know, that's truly great. Uh, different shots with the camera. As I said, I'm not a big fan, but I, got, I learned the basics. And I think the basics are the key to learning how to go further in this field. And it just, that was probably the biggest thing I'll take from this class, was learning the essentials of what I need to do with the camera. And um, lastly, how important the team concept is. It's a team effort. You can't do, I want to do that documentary all by myself. I ended up needing a partner there. If I was to do something on this scale now, with, uh, I would need a huge crew. I realized that you can't do it by yourself. You need people around you. You seem to have produced a lot of works, Ryan. Now, tell us about the coffee sequence, campus story, fall foliage. Uh, well, the first one I actually did was the shoe tie sequence. It was just the basic project that uh, I did to get my feet wet with the camera, different angles. The amazing Eric Davis helped me out. He, uh, it was a basic uh, shoe tie, just tie a shoe and you know, uh, uh, look happy for the camera. But it really helped me uh, learned the camera. It was excellent. I uh, can't be happier with how it went. And uh, he's going to give the big thumbs up here. He, Eric Davis did a great job. He helped me out a lot. The fall foliage was interesting. Composition and framing were really important. Uh, I learned what really makes a shot work. I put a lot of effort into this. I actually had to do like three different shoots because I didn't realize that three, even as an editor, three minutes with uh, just basic composition shots is really a hard time to fill. But overall, I'm happy with my project. I hope Stoney Duren's happy with the project. Um, but I had a really good time with this, and I learned a lot. This was the biggest piece of um, filming I had to do with like camera heavy. So I'm glad that I got a chance to do this and um, I learned a lot with it. Lastly, I had um, uh, the campus story. My great friend Andrew Schillinglaw and Eric Davis's hand, as you see on screen, helped out. This was, this was my forte. This is what I want to do, editing, telling a story. I'm going to talk more about this in a second, but um, just the campus story was the culmination of the class for me, the best project I got to do, the one I'm most happy with. I had a blast doing it, and uh, really a nice icing on the cake for uh, what I did during the television production course. It was nothing but peaches and cream for me. It was awesome. Truly, truly awesome. So you, our guest today, Mr. Ryan, you have a mount mountains of experience. Now, tell us about your best project. Uh, well, as I said, the, my campus story, Just Look Down, uh, starring Andrew Schillinglaw, was easily the most fun I had. Um, the general gist of the story is he's an NCC student, uh, played by, as I said, my good friend Andrew Schillinglaw. He loses his copy of the phenomenal show, Veronica Kumar, starring Kristen Bell, who is the best actress in the country, mind you. Um, he's supposed to bring this DVD to his professor to watch, and they can discuss things, but he loses it. I, by the character I play, ultimately steals it. I'm kind of a scoundrel with the S. But um, he, he, the biggest uh, the plot point is he's searching for it, but uh, we just had a great time shooting it. Um, the, uh, this, I did all, uh, everything I learned all semester culminated with this. Um, I love telling visual stories. I used to be a writer, but I got sick of writing. Too much work. Um, so editing was just a blast. This was, I really, I mean, I know I'm just going on and on, but I can't explain how good of a time I had shooting this. Andrew did a great job. He, ha he uh, rushed from his uh, Notre Dame uh, ha Catholic High School to help me out with this. We had a great day of shooting. I was thrilled with the story. The NCC Music Library, big ups to them because the score that I used for this, many different songs, was just matched perfectly and I had a great time. 
Ryan, you seem to have a lot of uh, interesting works. Now, what would you like to create next? My, uh, I would definitely, while I'm here at NCC with the great help of Stony Duran, I would uh, like to make an independent film within the next two years. I have ca countless ideas. I just need to figure out how to mold them and tell a specific story. Uh, my long-term goal is to move out to California with my good buddies at Iron Sink and hopefully get a television show in Greenlight. I think that would be, you know, TV is really what I want to do. I love uh, episodic, serialized stories, and um, to get do a TV show with them would be a dream come true. And, um, what, and another thing that I have in the back of my mind, I would like to revisit Poignancy Precise. I think with more time, more effort, more experience, that could be a viable project that maybe could make us a lot of money someday. So I definitely would like to look into that and hopefully you know, make it a big time hit. Oh, that's good. <laughs> so today we got to meet someone who has seen the film industry from the inside and he knows what it takes to put together us features as a new TV director. He hopes to apply what he has learned at NCC to document other films and the fantasy football experiences. He also plans to use the new knowledge from Television One to advance standing in the film industry as he progresses. We would like to thank Ryan for joining us today. I could not be happier to be here. It was thank a pleasure. Thank, thank you. you so much. No, thank you. Thank you. You are welcome another time. Okay. We hope that you enjoyed our program and meeting you as well. This is our future future hopes. We hope to continue to join each one of, of you to watch this progress as the good days come. Thank you. Thank you. And good night. This has been The New Directors. Yep. The Nora This has been a, The New Directors, an NCC student production. <laughs>